Uh, here's a live look at downtown with Wells Fargo Arena off to the left. You can barely see anything right now. Uh, March Madness happening right now under its roof and you can see not at all a pleasant day out there. Uh, Chief Meteorologist Brad Edwards uh, will have more on what to expect during March Madness weather wise. But first, Raina Garcia joins us live from Hoops and Hops. We've already seen a big upset happening in the first round of the tournament. Yeah, the four seed Virginia was knocked out of the tournament by the 13 seed Furman. It's definitely uh, busted a lot of people's brackets, mine included. We all actually may have another upset brewing between Arizona and Princeton. That's a 2 and 15 matchup. But looking ahead to one of the games we have going on tonight are, is the Iowa Hawkeyes taking on Auburn in their first game of the tournament. This is an 8-9 matchup, so no major upset alert to look forward to like that Virginia Furman game. And yesterday we heard Fran McCaffrey talk about that Auburn defense. It's really tough and they have great shot blocking ability and they defend the three ball really well. So if they want to avoid an early exit like last year, they'll definitely need big performances from Philip Rebracha and Chris Murray along with some good guard play. That game will be tipping off here in less than an hour. We got a pretty good turnout here for that game. So we'll see if the Hawkeyes can get it done. Stephanie. Looks like a lot of fun. All right, Raina, thank you so much. Well, Hoops and Hops is happening nearly all night long until 10 p.m. And uh, whether you're a passive basketball fan or a diehard, it's an atmosphere built for everyone. Yeah, three to 500 people in there all cheering, usually for the same thing. Um, and it's fun. It's even fun to watch, uh, uh, say, like a game that nobody really cares about it comes down to the end. And, and all of a sudden, everybody's a fan of what's going on, uh, and screaming and yelling for that last shot. So it's, it really makes it fun. Hoops and Hops is open 10 to 10 every day through Saturday, and if you're worried about the cold, it's a heated tent, and the drinks from the Iowa Craft Beer Tent may help as well. If you can't make Hoops and Hops, uh, try Fan Fest. This is happening now at the Iowa Event Center, Hall C. Catch Des Moines says you can experience the atmosphere of March Madness without a ticket to the games. Fan Fest is free with plenty of TVs. You can also get food and drinks here. Tonight's the only night Fan Fest is available.